Hello everyone. Uh, today I'm going to be um, painting the back of the uh, aquarium. Uh, so yesterday <clears throat> I uh, drilled the holes for the aquarium on another episode. So today I'm going to just go ahead and um, paint the back uh, with uh, a darker blue. Um, some frame primer color, uh, indoor outdoor. Uh, it's called glossy blue, true blue. So we're going to be doing that. Uh, but first you gotta have to make sure you prep it. Um, I went ahead and put some Windex, used some Windex on it and cleaned the glass real good. And I gotta make sure that glass is really clean. I know some people like to use alcohol. Um, you can use either. Um, just make sure that this surface is clean as possible and lit free. Um, today's not very windy so you won't get too much dust hopefully flying around. And then after I clean it, I have this uh, non non um, cotton that shouldn't have any any fuzz on it or anything like that okay so we clean up really well so literally the hard part is just to make sure you tape everything off make sure you tape er tape everything off so that the sides or any other surfaces won't get um, you know won't get uh, uh, paint on it so so I just use some blue tape you know it doesn't have to be perfect but the better you do it, the less work at the end to to, uh, to fix it. So if you do it right, then you don't have to fix it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> mm -hmm. Alrighty. So remember the bottom is going to be full of sand anyway, so you're not going to see it that much okay uh, it's just trying to trying to get it so where you don't uh, overspray it and make a mess of everything so I'm gonna do the blue and then I'm gonna do um, a newspaper over the red okay so I'm gonna go ahead and do everything and then after I do this I'll continue with uh, the rest of the uh, the paint all right we'll see you in a little bit Okay, so I uh, taped everything up. So uh, really, just to make sure that wherever you're uh, taping off is you're trying to protect the tank from overspray on the glass. And if you do, you could just scrape it off. But you know, the, the better job that you do prepping, then the less cleanup you have to deal with. So I did, uh, I taped all sides, uh, except for the um, I got to do the bottom still, and then, and then we'll be ready to paint. But just uh, I just used a regular uh, painter's tape and some newspaper, and that's what uh, that's all I did was that um, simple. So just keep it simple and cheap, and then when you uh, the, the better job that you do, the 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 easiest to pull off and not have to clean up after yourself okay so I'm gonna go ahead and finish up the bottom here because I'm gonna lay it flat it's look like it's gonna rain soon so I'm gonna need to hurry up and paint this thing and then move it inside okay I'll see you in a little bit all right uh, when I was looking around I actually forgot to tape up the holes so I had to rip, rip off some, some of the uh, the newspaper to uh, take the holes. Yeah, you want to spray and then go inside a tank. I forgot all about the holes that you got to patch up. So it's just little tiny details that you forget and mistakes that I make that you know that you can uh, learn from them <laughs> and uh, don't make that same mistake as I do. But uh, yeah, I forgot to I forget to tape up these holes that I I made. Overspray to go inside the tank. I think the wind is starting to pick up. So I might have to move this inside to paint it. Well, not inside, but in the garage to paint it. I'd rather do it out here, but I don't think it's gonna it's gonna work because it's, it's starting to the wind's starting to pick up. Let's 
see. Let's see which way. Let's see which way the wind's blowing. It's blown out. Gotta make sure it doesn't run. I'm not liking the spray. It's too um, it's not spread out enough. Yeah, I'm not liking it at all. Okay, so I flipped, I flipped it back. Um, maybe the wind is blowing it, and that's why it's very, uh, it's not evenly um, spreading out. So I'm gonna try it this way and see if it's. Fumes is getting to me. Let me see. I uh, I get a mask on and spray some more because it's kind of close. Okay, I got a mask on. Let's do some more spraying. I think it's the wind. It's, it's pushing the paint uh, before it hits the the glass. So I'll see if I can um, wait until the wind dies down a little bit. Every time the wind dies down, I can paint. Yeah, just if I have to just do um, two or three coats, I think, and uh, every uh, 10 or 15 minutes in between coats to let it dry, and that should be okay. So let me do that, and I'll, I'll, I'll come back and give, uh, show you the finished product. Okay, so I finished um, painting everything. Um, I start out with the blue, and then. I let that dry and I finished off with the black on top so that way <clears throat> the back of it is it's black. I mean you could have leave it at blue too but I uh, wanted to have the back black on top of the blue to cover it up. Um, and then there's a nice thick layer of paint on, on the back too so when uh, you know your plumbing's back there uh, I'm gonna see if I have time to uh, spray paint the uh, plumbing too that way it'd be all black. Um, so but anyway, so it's all finished. So I'm just letting it dry. So I just have to know that I did the blue and then I did the black on top just to cover it up. It, and then it also probably make the blue a little darker too because the, uh, the background of the blue um, would probably show through the light we show through. But now that it's black, the, uh, the light wouldn't go through the, uh, the back of it. Okay, so I'll let you take a little, look a little bit closer. Uh, it's just a... Uh, you know, it's not perfect, but um, I don't think it, it needs to be. All right. Uh, any any type of uh, paint that um, adhere to uh, 
multiple surfaces would work. So, okay, all right. The sun's coming up, so we'll hopefully it'll dry in about half an hour enough to be able to touch, and then I can bring it inside and then uh, put it back on the stand and maybe start plumbing it. Okay, and we'll put that on the next uh, episode. All right, so that's all it is. It's pretty easy. All right. I know a lot of people like to have uh, black um, as a background, but I thought that, you know, everybody wants a black background, so I thought I'd do something different and have a, a blue background. Okay, we'll see you on the next uh, next episode. Thank you for watching. Please uh, push like and subscribe. Thank you.